<laughs> All right, guys, believe it or not, you can AFK the new Dragon Ball raids. And this is how. I know people don't want to spend all day playing the game. So just do this, set this up, and you can go out and just leave this running in the background. It's, it's great. But how do we do it? First of all, you need to go in and see if you can solo Act 4. If you could do that, you can probably do this method. If you are struggling to do that, try and get some of the margin marks. They are very useful. They give uh, damage buffs. It would probably be better to have a unique. I know not everyone has it, but if you can have one, it's going to help a lot, okay? So if you have one, you're probably set. I want to get this video out. It's, it's, the update's pretty much just come out, but I know people just don't want to sit on their computer all day. So I'm not going to gatekeep this. I'm putting this video out, okay? I'm not like that. So, um, yeah, let's set up a tiny task. It's using tiny task, by the way. If you don't know how to get that, good luck getting it because I ain't showing. I'm trying to do this as fast as possible so I can get this method out as fast as possible. But you're probably just going to want a recording hotkey of whatever and a playback hotkey of whatever. But this is important. Make sure you have continuous playback on. Make sure there is a tick next to it. Otherwise, your macro will not be playing back. This is the loadout I personally use. You guys can use something different. But yeah, you just want to go in, load up, act four, start it up. And the minute you load in, you want to press your recording hotkey. Mine's F8. I don't know what you guys use. The second you see yourself load in. I'm not sure if this works in every single spot. Because sometimes I think you can spawn in different spots. It has worked for me perfectly. So I just want to get this to you guys as fast as possible. So yeah, when you load in, I've already started my recording. I didn't really mention it, but I did say as soon as you load in, start your recording. You want to wait a couple seconds, maybe give it like 20 seconds to load in because sometimes your computer is slower than other times. Uh, yeah, I might give it five more seconds. Four, three, two, one and start. There we go. So it's pretty much the same as the Jojo method. If you guys have watched that video, there is no air units on this level. So it's pretty easy to AFK. It's, it's, it's really good, man. I love this. So yeah, when you get your money, you just want to place it down. Simple as this. It's literally basic. It's like you're playing a game normally. Try not to move around though. And definitely try not to scroll out. You can, but I prefer not to. If you're going to do it, don't use your mouse wheel. Use the... Uh, I think there's a special button. I forgot where they were. But yeah, you just want to get set up at the beginning normally. For me, I have unique stay and I'm lucky enough to have a unique. If you don't have unique, I wish you the best of luck. I don't really know. This is just a method, okay? If your units aren't good enough, it's not really my fault. I'm just trying to help. But yeah, I like to upgrade my stay in a bit. Just a bit. Probably after this upgrade. And now I'm going to start getting my money unit. Because money is definitely important. Uh, you can see we're starting to struggle a bit so make sure you're still upgrading your money i mean your attack unit you have to kind of balance it because these guys even with all my buffs they are still pretty hard to kill i have a slow unit so i'm gonna go and place that down and probably set it on last there we go that's gonna help a lot it's also gonna help with shields because some of the enemies have shield so if you can bring a multi-hit unit there you go i've upgraded my stain again these guys are kind of annoying, the big guys. They could be quite tanky, so watch out for them. If you have any Usopp's, he's probably quite good as well. But there is no air units. Just in case something leaks though, Usopp might be able to take care of it. I don't have Usopp, but if I did have him, I'd probably try and bring him. But yeah, I have some time here to upgrade my money unit, so that's what I'm going to do. There you go, I can upgrade again nice we could also upgrade our money unit i know we can't we can soon though it does get a little bit close at times so make sure you guys have the damage buffs if you don't have the damage buffs it's going to be kind of a struggle you can do other stages as well it doesn't need to be stage four if you need to go and do stage three or something man i'm probably going to pop a blood curdle here because uh there's quite a few getting through there we go but yeah, I'm about to get an ability called Blade Dance, which just is going to carry me all the way to the end, basically. It's a really good ability. It makes his AoE quite big. And then after we max out our stain a bit, uh, we'll probably get an Irons down. There we go. I should be chilling. I'm going to get a Blood Curdle. I'm just going to use it whenever I can, to be honest. But yeah, I like to get one more upgrade on my Bulmar before I uh, get Irons down. Actually, that was a lie. I'm probably going to get him down now because uh, they're kind of coming a bit closer. 
As I said, sometimes it can mess up. This isn't a like, it's a, it's kind of a rough method, okay? I literally just found this out. I had to test it. I, I had it running for like an hour and it seemed to be working. Yeah, I've got Iron Style now and I'm gonna upgrade him. And now we're gonna try and max out our money unit because we should be fine now. We literally, like we can go all the way to the end at this point. It's a breeze. There you go, we can upgrade our money unit. All right, we're about to max out our money unit. So now I can literally just focus on stain and irons. And yeah, the rest is pretty much just upgrading and winning. All right, there you go. We've killed the boss. So what you want to do now, you just want to wait in this screen for a bit because sometimes it will take longer than others. Like, each time it might take a different amount of time. So I suggest waiting like 30 seconds. Not too long, but also not too fast. All right, I've waited 30 seconds. So I'm just going to click a bit on the screen and then press next. There we go. Click again, click again. And then you're going to press replay. But the minute we press replay, when you load in, you want to stop your recording and instantly start it, okay? You're going to have to be kind of fast with it. But it should be fine. So for me, it's F8 to stop and then Control Shift Alt P to start. So F8, Control Shift Alt P. And we're in a different position, yeah, but it shouldn't really affect too much. There's still the space to put them down. So yeah, I'll just show you guys some footage of the macro working. Mm -hmm. 